and the adventure today, you will see something that you haven't seen before. A weird twist of events that leads to us finally raiding one of the biggest bases on the server and trying out multiple methods to get in. How did I get in this situation? Well, it starts in a very, very normal way. On the coast, ready to head inland. And without spoiling too much, you will never guess what happens in this story. But first, it was time to run around the map, getting gear. Right, so we got the black market trader there. The Pova bank robbery. I remember these two. Auto trader, helicopter, I didn't even, I didn't even visit that. <clears throat> so I'm probably going to try and build like in Severo. I see there's a building trader now. I'm not too sure what that's about, but I think I'm going to build in like Severo Grand Area. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I have made my way inland as a solo. I say inland, but I'm at Devil's Castle right now. I found a Mosin, I found a, a little locker. And I'm just checking Devil's Castle right now because um, I, I, I want to know first of all if there's a base here. And I want to also know if there is uh, there are any guns. And there is a gun here. I got the scope for it. So I got a hunting scope and a tundra. No bullets though. I'll take it, I'll take it. Um, yeah, my plan is basically just to go and collect some valuables, collect some base building stuff, uh, stuff that I need, like the mandatory stuff. And then I will probably try and build a base in Severo, but I'm gonna keep walking, I'm, I'll see what happens. So, uh, what the fuck is that? Why the fuck is there a plane in the sky? What the f*** is going on? That's the black market. That's a fucking plane. And here's a heli crash, I think. With a f ton of zombies on it. How many zombies are there? I'm just gonna have to knife one by one. Come on, big boy. I don't really even remember what the server or the loot on the server is like, so it's gonna be a bit random. There's a zombie in this heli crash, bro. Tactical belt, uh, mag, 50 cal ammo. I don't have a gun for it though. Box of ammo, patrol pens, AWM. Damn. Okay, get that in. Uh, I'll take the can of food. I need that, and then vector. Okay, we need to be careful because there's, there's more zombies. Zombies are a small problem, but this heli crash is definitely not bad. Oh wait, there's already a mag in the AWM. Wait, reload it. Yeah, we're good to go. We're loaded. Let's go. Now, after getting these two guns, I was more confident to go into the black market and see what was going on there. Maybe I could catch some players lacking, or I could find some loot that I could use or sell. Okay, so it might be very dumb for me to go in there, as there might be geared, geared players. Um, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Can I open this? Bro, I wanna open this door, come on. Open the f***ing door! <laughs> okay, it doesn't work. Okay, you know what? I will go and check inside the actual uh, selling place, because I know you can sell inside this big um, industrial building. I'm gonna be careful for the zombies though, because there's a bunch of them out here. I'm gonna lead them into this. I can't open this door either, bro, what? Okay, I'm gonna aggro them all. I'm gonna aggro all the zombies. And then I'm gonna jump on top of this. I can I can open this one. And I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna trap all of them, open up, and they get them all to me. And this is actually a very good trick for you guys as well. Um, they're all gonna come to me, and all they're all gonna go to my location, which is on top of this container in the back. And then I'm gonna go to the front, close it up, and they're all in there. I don't want to shoot actually. Hold up. Let me uh, knife this guy down. Why are these zombies always give me a cut, bro? Yellow health now, too. Okay, I'm trying to figure out why these container doors are not opening, but it's fine. Imagine there's a guy in here, that would be crazy. Okay, we're good. There's many uh, different cell points here, so I need to quickly figure out which one is which. Um, at least we're clear. Yeah, 15k, 15k, and 30k, so that is uh, less ideal. 
And then we got storage here. So I got this rifle safe. Uh, which is actually pretty good. So I'm not going to sell it. I'm going to keep it. I need to figure out where I can sell guns. I think this, this is the place for collectibles. So we got dog tags you can collect and then sell. So if you kill a player. Teddy bears. Got some teddy bears. And then we got uh, gems. Which probably you can get on the server. I don't know how. But we're going to figure that out I guess. And this is going to have to be the weapons one right? Yeah there we go. You know, the sellables are a bit crazy. I don't think I can really sell my guns that I have, so that's a little bit unfortunate. They're not valuable enough. Uh, I guess I'm I guess I'm still brokey. I'm still I'm still poor. So I'm gonna try and see if I can find the base building stuff, I guess, because if I can't buy it here, then I'm gonna have to actually find it, which is a lot more work. But it's fine. I'll go and I'll go and do it. Wait, what is that? Supplies have been dropped near Severograd. Wait, that's good, because I'm going there. So that's that's perfect, because I'm looking for base pulling stuff. The airdrop actually might have it. That'd, that'd be insane. Okay, let me, let me, let me see then. There's a very high chance, considering there's a huge, huge base to the right, that this airdrop is going to be looted, but I'm just going to go for it and see. There's a zombie somewhere here. So I've actually got uh, two suppressed guns now. I've got this one suppressed gun, which is the close range. It's an AR. And then I've got a sniper, which is suppressed. There's only three away, but I think I can use it to shoot the zombies, which... Actually, now that I'm, now that I'm saying this, the zombies are still there. So there's a there's a, actually a high chance that it's not looted then. Alright, that should be it. Uh, that should be all the zombies. I saw all suppressed, so I'm assuming that base doesn't know that I'm here. But I shouldn't know. My backpack is full of loot from the black market. It wasn't much, but it was it was alright loot. I figured it was okay to take. The question is, airdrop has... Mm, oh, heavy vest. That's huge. That is huge. I put the plate... I cannot put the pouches on, but I can take the plate with me, I guess. If I drop that. Get that. What is this? Uh, level 2 keycard. M2483. I will take that for the G383. Then this... The mag, that's probably going to be it, I just want to check quickly. Oh no, we got pills, we got a mag. Yeah, I think that's that's, that's about as far as we're going we're gonna to get here for this airdrop. Now, as I said earlier, my goal with this was to loot around in Severo and finally set up a base. Now, as you can see in my inventory, I had none of the resources required. And the only thing I really had was a locker or a rifle safe, which I could store some extra guns in. But I checked every set in the town and I tried to get lucky and I hoped to get all the stuff that I needed. And it took me some time of looting but eventually I found some of the resources that I needed and I decided to try and set up my first base. I just need to get the code lock set up. There we go. And what's a good code? That's good. Yeah, copy paste it. Okay, I got my gate set up. Lovely. Looks like a little, a little uh, wonder base. I mean, it looks like a wonder base, and it is a wonder base. So, I guess if anyone tries to raid it, they'll notice instantly that it's a wonder base in the industrial. But I guess it's pretty hidden. I guess for now, it's a pretty hidden base. Uh, at least for now, I say that, because if I expand then I'm gonna actually take over the entire industrial building, then it's gonna be less hidden, let's just, let's just put it that way. Um, but for now it's fine. And I'm going to store all my loot, because this is, uh, way too much. I wanna put down the locker as well. Oh, it's, yeah, right, it's a safe, it's a safe, okay, I need to say that, okay. So I'm gonna put it like this, I think, so I can access it, but it's not in plain sight. Uh, and then, I don't have a code lock for this, but I think it's fine without a code lock for now. I'm gonna put the extra guns, uh, where did I put them? Okay, so I'm gonna put these guns in here, uh, I'm gonna put the building tools, yeah, I'm gonna put the building stuff in this, I'm gonna put the guns inside these safe. Uh, cause that has gun slots, there we go. One gun in there, two guns, okay. I tried to already expand to see if I could do it, but I think I have not enough resources, not enough nails. It's a bit laggy as well. I'm waiting. Okay, there we go. It's lagging a little bit. 
and there is for some reason a sound of a plane. Why is there a sound of a plane? Or is it a helicopter? It's a helicopter, isn't it? It's a, hel it's a heli. I need to get down there. This thing is way too loud as well. It's definitely going to the big base. It must be, right? Hey, where is it? It's already landing, probably. It was a huge heli as well, so... Oh, there it is. I don't want to shoot yet. If it's landing in that big base, I'm definitely gonna... It's definitely gonna shoot at it. Oh, the gate is there. Did he land it? I think he fucked the landing up. He messed it up, I think. Lagging. <laughs> Bro. He's flown away. What is going on? Did he crash? There's no way he's crashing, right? There's no way he just... What's going on? There's people in the base, because he must have opened the door, so it's good to keep in mind that there's people active in the base. But I think he's crashed, bro. I think he has crashed. Okay, so it turns out he hasn't crashed. He's still still alive and well in the air. Um, but this is the bit. Let's do it in there. Can I headshot this guy? Please tell me I can take this guy's face off. Oh, I, I should have done it. But I don't know if this wall banks. I don't think it does. It's not the kill. It's not even a kill, bro. What? How is it not a kill? Holy. <laughs> what is going on, bro? <laughs> the hell is flying off. It's left. They're too scared. And this guy isn't dead. He should be dead, bro. That should have been a kill. Come on. Let me get... Let me get... Try number two. Okay, yeah, that's a shit angle. That is not good. Alright, I'm gonna dip, because I don't think I'm gonna get anything out of this, really. Realistically. Oh, there's a guy there, there's a guy, there's a guy. For, uh, okay. He's in the middle of the road, and he's seen me, he's aiming at me. Now, the question is, am I gonna be able to catch him here? Oh, he's there. I missed. Oh, I'm gonna shot it from the base, I think. I was, a silent snaps behind me, I don't know if you guys can hear it in the video, but... Silent snaps behind me. The heli's loud above my head. Alright, so I'm not gonna lie. I just waited here for like a minute so that the heli is gone. So I can properly speak to you guys without having the heli sounds. Wait, he's here! Dead. Damn, bro. There might be more in the town, though. I saw at least two guys in the base. And then one was in the heli. And the heli is gone, so... Can I loot him? I don't know if I should loot him. I was guns, I guess. Nothing interesting. Oh! I just got shot up by an M200, bro. I swear to god, that was an M200. Oh my god, bro. You know what? Since I'm a solo and there are definitely multiple people, I'm gonna go stash the loot inside my base and then continue. <laughs> because if they... If I die right now, I lose everything that I have, really. Get this extra gun inside the base and then I'm good to go. Alright, I'm gonna try and see if I can kill this guy in the base, because he's been, uh... I think they haven't landed the heli yet, either. Wait, he's there, isn't he? Is that him? It is him. And he also instantly see me, so that's uh, also interesting. Wait. Wait, I'm getting shot at by close, bro. What? He's close. He's, like, on the house next to me. Am I going insane? hear him outside. I swear I just heard him 100%. Can't go on a roof here. Maybe this will work. Can't hear him anymore though. He's, he might be... Might have just run past. But now I'm kind of scared that he might be waiting for me to get out of this building. Take that backpack. Maybe in the base. No way, right? Yeah, that was a risky shot to take. I suppose I suppose that is hard to hit. But he's there. 
I can block the shot. There still. Dead, let's go. Headshot, there we go. Uh, other way to move out. That guy must have been geared. He's also gillied up. Oh, and I'm gonna get the whole zombie army on me, of course. Nice. Whoa. Okay, that's too dead. I did not expect him to be there. Take his main stuff. Oh wait, he had a, he had a, a plate, a big plate and a, and a big backpack. Right, can I loot this guy? I can think I can loot him. Big plate, big vest, the nades, get all this stuff. Don't got time. I, I, I don't want to risk it for too long, because if there's a guy camping there, he could easily one tap me. And there might be a guy in one of these houses as well. I mean, considering I saw two guys in the base, and I see two guys outside, and then there's also a guy in the heli, there must, there must be a big squad. It must be. I'd argue probably the biggest squad on the server, at least, as far as I know at the moment. This gun this is good, though. The, the Wimble, or uh, Imbo AI2. IA2. Now that brings me to the next question. Is there still two guys in the base, or is there just one guy in the base? I can probably find that out, because this guy's probably not leaving. There's a window open. I don't think this guy's ever left this base in his lifetime. Okay, there's one guy in there for sure. He just he probably just saw me. Gotta be careful, there's also no people behind me. There's another guy in there. Not sure how that wasn't a hit, but... There's two guys in there because there was two windows open. And one was closed just now. The other one was also uh, closed by the guy that I shot at. So there's two guys in the base left. So... I can loot this guy further, right? No, I can't. I feel like these shots m should be hitting, like... I feel like they should be. But you know what? I doubt that these guys uh, are actually eight people on the server. I doubt they're an eight, an eight man. I think it's like seven allowed on the server. So, two dead, two inside base. Uh, one in the heli. I'd argue there's probably not many of them else online. So I'm probably just going to go and loot this guy. Also a heavy plate. Okay. M200? Okay. Now we're in business. Let me get this heavy plate in. Uh, not space. Can I double carry? Should I? Is that worth it? I don't know if that's, that's probably not smart, right? To have like a backpack in my hands and then carry it. Should probably just put this on the ground. M200 also. Oh. Right, I'm gonna get this guy's heavy plate and his backpack and then I'm gonna depot it in base. I think that's the plan. Heavy plate, bacon, IFAC I'll take, canteen. Uh, anything else? Pouches, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna dip to base. I made it back. I'm not sure if this is good or bad news, but um, I've ran out of storage. <laughs> so I'm gonna use the storage with the most important stuff that I have. Um, these rifle bags are huge. They have so many slots, so I kinda wanna keep them. But at the same time, I don't really have storage for them. My rifle save is already full. And I've also got that t tier 2 keycard to do, which I'm probably gonna do next. Uh, I got their, their white car key, um, so that might be for the heli. I'm not too sure, but if it is, that'd be, that is funny. Uh, a white car key for the heli, man. That is... Ugh. <laughs> There's no way they, they left it there. But yeah, I depoted all the loot that is necessary to be depoted. Got the honey badger, got some other stuff. Uh, it's actually some pretty alright guns. I think this AR-15 is also going to do bits in the future. Uh, of course, I got the Wembo AI. Or AA2. Uh, those guns, they got 15 round mags. They've got suppressors. They're, they're snacked, uh, snacked up. Got the M200. Um, yeah, I think that's basically it. Okay, so you might be able to hear it, but there's a guy uh, running around the base. So I think they found my base, unfortunately. Now he's he's checking it out, I think. He might be inside or outside the building, but I can barely hear him. They might have, they might have found uh, my one door. <laughs> that wouldn't be ideal. He just, he just ran above me. He just ran above me. Oh, sh <clears throat> multiple of them outside. I heard like three or four. This is not looking too good. This is really not looking too good. Hatchet. What? 
So he's dismantling it. I shouldn't have opened it. Oh my god, it's almost opened my base. Hey, we can talk about this, bro. You don't have to raid me like that, bro. Come on. Really? Alright, so you said you wanted to talk about this? Yeah, bro. Let's go. What's happening? Entirely sure, but we just noticed somebody new was in town. And, you know, we wasn't sure if you guys were going to be friendly or not. Well, it depends. Are you guys the the big base? Uh, very well could be, yes. So it uh, might occur that I haven't been as uh, friendly as, uh, yeah, you might imagine. Yeah, yeah, just yeah, a bit. You, you kind of uh, shot me in the face. I might have done that, yeah. You shot both of us in the face, actually. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, that might you be... You stole this man's honey badger, man. That That is his prized possession. The honey badger? Okay. Yeah. Well, to, yeah, to be honest... the honey badger is my favorite weapon. Hmm. Well, I just, I just literally built this base, like... Uh, not even... Like, just, just before that fight started, I just, just built this base. So, I'm not too sure what you think you can get out of this base, but, uh... There's not much in there. So, um, you know, I don't want to alarm you, but I do know your voice, and I do know you are a YouTuber. YouTuber? What? What? Fuck. I love your videos. Which videos? What? Huh? 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 <laughs> I'm so fucked. Come on, Sid. <laughs> don't play games, bro. Hey, who said, bro? Who said? What? Huh? I'm fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm fucked. Alright, so, um, I will not continue to raid you, uh, as long as you don't attack us again. Is that cool? So, it depends, it depends what attacking means. Does that mean if I see someone attacking, I'm not allowed to shoot, or does it mean I'm not allowed to, like, wait until you guys do something with the helicopter, or what, what are you thinking? Uh, so, I would appreciate if you wouldn't attack us, you know, when we're trying to get in or out of our base with our helicopter. Uh, okay. We, we'll leave you alone. Okay. Uh, you know, we can, if you want, uh, we could possibly make, like, a group line. So, like, you know, if you were getting attacked or whatnot, you know, we could help you out. And, you know, if we're getting attacked, you just let us know. Right. Right. Okay. Uh, I mean, that works. <clears throat> I mean, I don't really have to shoot at you guys heli. I just hope that I could get a free heli, like, an hour into playing the server, to be honest. Um, but... <laughs> I, d hey, I don't blame you. <laughs> that would make for a hell of an intro. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, unfortunately, that didn't work, but I'm not too... too I'm, not, I'm not complaining about the, the loot that I got, so... Um, yeah, how can I put this? I'll probably... You good, bro? <laughs> Right. Um, you know, also, unlike the the rest of the guys in my group, I'm a very chill Daisy player. I'm not huge into the PvP. Bro. I'm more into, you know, like, you know, getting people together and, you know, just kind of role-playing and or doing random shit and helping each other out. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. That's telling me his life story at the moment. I'm, I'm kind of like him, but I'm, ex I'm down to execute a fool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this guy... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's just because, you know, ADHD, murder, but you know... Mm, okay. Uh... <laughs> okay, bro. Then there's also another option is that we do it together and we try and figure out uh, if we can find an enemy together, like a an enemy that we both have, and then raid them, if that's okay for you the guys. The only people that we uh, we find is even somewhat of a threat is uh, Lynx. Is Lynx. Okay. Yeah. Lynx and Knight, I think they're like a duo, but they're pretty big, or uh, the STR people. There was two other groups that were in the server that were pretty big, um, pretty sure we ran them off it, but... Hmm, okay, so that's... Also, as a good faith, um, I'm gonna run back to the base and we gonna grab a few things, uh, to help you get a little bit of a jump start on, uh, on your first time, you know, on the server with us. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> that just changed really quick from from uh, the hatchet on my door to 
to help me out. <laughs> and this is the moment where I said it. It changed really quickly from them trying to raid me to them just trying to be friendly and actually getting something going. And there was something suspicious going on and I didn't really believe him. I figured that if I opened this door they would probably shoot me in the face. But I obtained some valuable information from this conversation. But as you can imagine this encounter led to something else. We're not as nice as our teammates. We, we have you surrounded. We can do one of two things. We can choose either one. You give the tapper back and you leave this city. Or two, you raid in and you leave this city. Alright bro, alright, come on. This is our city. Now what if I told you that I stashed the tapper and you're not getting that? <gasps> then we're I'm still ready you because this is our city. You have filled this city. <laughs> <laughs> True, but that sounds kind of nice. Let me have a moment, man. So, you which have... one of the two choices will it be? I know there's, there's isn't it isn't it allowed since we haven't you haven't hit me? I just grab all the important stuff and I log off. Isn't that allowed? Isn't that a third option that you have to have missed? Hey, but if we hit the wall with the hatchet, man, like now you uh, yeah, it's got minutes ready. left. Yeah. Tick. That's unfortunate. Tick. Tuck. Guys! Just let's get started. Don't shoot, he can't hit me. Hey! Ah! Yo, yo! What have I, bro? What have I just heard, man? What have I heard? Uh, I think Ash is like uh, 15, 20. Oh, this guy's dad definitely, definitely left him. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Accurate. <laughs> now, all jokes aside and all the weirdness out of the way, they put a hatchet on my door, and 10 minutes later, boom. I am ruining all the stuff inside this base. So they don't have anything. I'm literally ruining keycards and ruining armor and, and guns. So they won't, will not be able to, to get it. These guys can get fucked. I don't understand. Why, why don't you guys want to do He's definitely. Bro. What am I just watching? You know, oh, the cool lock snapped. Fire, they, some they raided it. It's know, done. Yeah. I'm dead. And there's four more. Why is there fucking seven of them, bro? Bro, there's so many of them. I thought there was like three of them. Three of them just like messing about. I didn't know it was like six of them, bro. Now there's one thing that is very important here. And the most important part is the fact that they gave me valuable information. Obviously, all of my loot was gone, and I had nothing left, but the only thing I did have left was a bit of hope. And that hope was that I could reach out to the people that they named as their enemies, and try and get against them. The only people that we, uh, we find is even somewhat of a threat is, uh, Lynx. Is Lynx. Okay. Lynx and Knight. I think they're like a duo, but they're pretty bad. Lynx and Knight. Well, Lynx and Knight, I think, were the answer to this, to this, to this situation. I had to get my revenge on this big, big clan, and these were their enemies. So what I did is I went into the community Discord of this server, and I tried to find a guy called Lynx. I reached out to him, and he responded back to me with an interesting response. Now, he was planning to raid them on Wednesday, and asked me to join. And I was very happy to hear this, because this was my exact plan in the long run. But this plan in the long run became the plan in the short run. Because we were about to raid this base with this new friend that I made via Discord, and we were about to get revenge on these guys. So I hopped in a call with him to discuss some standard matters about what the raid was going to be like, what his plan was, 
and obviously since I wasn't the one grinding for these raid tools, I let him decide the entire plan. He wanted to do a little bit of an offline raid, he wanted to start early in the morning. I suggested that it would be cool to do it online, but he told me that this clan is so big that it's probably not even going to be doable. He has one mate, so it's going to be three or four of us raiding and against eight of them. Yeah, well, this is it, yeah, so it's going to be at least ten doors to blow up. Um, and that uh, hospital building is, is they probably doored off, they probably T3 door every single floor. So there's probably like three doors per floor. So but I think when you get to the top, it's going to be completely open. Hmm. It depends on the door limit. What's the you ten? Know, is ten, it really yeah, ten doors uh, and then four tents? All right. So one thing needs to be clear, and that is the fact that these guys, um, they've all they're almost logged off. So we're just waiting uh, on his request for them to log off. I think Mr. X is left. He's the last one to to log off here, and uh, that's the moment that we're gonna try and hit this base. Now they've been acting like the big boys they've raided three bases today and uh one thing i did not show in the video was the fact that i rebuilt my base and uh yeah they offline raided that as well they took my workbench even so yeah they can't cry about any offline raids at this point so it's uh clear to me that they really want the smoke but that's no problem because uh we can give them that we can give them that so i'm <laughs> i'm happy they can get their payback they've been cocky in chat as well they did say sorry yesterday, but then they've been cookie today, so I, I can't really... I'll just let it go, I'm just gonna raid them, clean them out, and I hope they log on in the middle of the raid. I hope they don't start, like, are online when we start, but I hope they log on mid-raid. Um, I know my friend doesn't want that, uh, he wants to clean them out. I kinda wanna, like, have him online when the raid happens. But at the end of the day, it's his raid tool, so I'll leave it up to him. Alright, so this is, uh, the location of the raid camp. Now, the raid camp is supposed to be a place where we can store our loot. So the plan is that once we've raided them, we can go come back here and store all of our valuable stuff in here and then transport it from here to the actual main base. Alright, so they've come over here with their helicopters and cars and stuff. So the plan is basically to do to try something out first. So we're going to try a different strategy to raid. Normally you would raid uh, by just blowing up their doors. And we're going to try and see if we can raid through their helipad basically. And they've got a helipad where you can stand on the edge. And my plan is basically to try and use that uh, to open up their door and then get into to their possibly loot room. We're not too sure if their loot room is there, but I think it makes sense that it would be considering uh, they've got the building. So we're going to try and see if we can get that done. Now these helis are not fly very flyable. They're, they're going to fly, they're going to glitch around the, the thing I guess, and especially when we're rendering that base. I'll just stay here. Uh, no, you should fly off just in case. They might have name changed or something. So what I want to do is I want to jump on the edge here and I want to land on that ledge. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm going to get a lot of cuts from this barbed wire. Yeah, yeah, I need, to, I need to open up this gate though. Can I... I don't have enough... I, I can't reach it. If I can open this up, man. It's too high up. I can't reach it from here. Oh, I can access his sleeping bag, you. bro. Yeah, yeah, I can access his money, bro. I think this doesn't work. Let's let's be. It's safe to say that this first try is not gonna go anywhere. I'm gonna die. I'm so dead. GG's. Oh no. Unfortunately, my great great plan to open up that gate did not happen. I wanted to use that tent to give myself a little bit of a boost up to be able to open that door, but unfortunately, it wasn't possible. So my friend picked me up in the heli again, and we decided to go back to the location. Back to the place where we were about to go and hit this raid. Alright, so this is the uh, the kit they've given me, let's see. They've given me an M200, an, M an Imbel EA2. And then I've got this, uh, I've got these pants, shirt. I'm gonna put all this gear set on, I'm gonna head over there. Okay, so they tested it out. It's uh, not possible to do the plan that I had. It was a great plan, and it would have worked, but it's just, I just need, it's because of the barbed wire that they've done it. So we're going to go and raid it without, just with normal loot, and uh, we're going to see. Because at this point, it's not worth to keep dying, so we're just going to plant the C4. They've grinded for it anyway, they've got a bunch of it. No, come here, you want to see something cool? Come on. <laughs> Toss, where's that from? We're not gonna talk about it. 
There you go. Take take one of these. Take one of these for for server resets. I have one. I have one. Okay, I got one. Okay. Okay. One's enough. Wait, did the C four already explode? Yeah. There's landing lights on it. <laughs> Turn them off and on. Bro, what the? <laughs> not gonna lie, not gonna lie, that threw me off. You got the axles? <laughs> Exos, Exos, Exos. In there, or? There's no storage in this helicopter. Oh, there, I got him, yeah. Do you mind dropping one or two? Uh, yeah, I got a zombie, by the way. You wanna take an axle that, yeah? Beam, bam, bop. Bada bop, boom. Pow. Anyone logs on, it's, it's on. We're fighting. <laughs> you can't wait for that. <laughs> He's been messaging me all the time saying, well, let's do it, let's fucking kill him. <laughs> like, bro. Wait, you, know, you know how many comments I've had? People, I can people, imagine. People crying. Why are you offline raid him? Why are you? It's so sad. It's such pathetic. Or whatever. Whatever they be saying. Yeah. I think they don't understand the fact that we're literally, these guys literally raided everyone on the server. They're in, like a 10 man and we're supposed to fight them. That's okay, they'll come on. They didn't come on last time. We just need to empty this base. We need to make a decision on what we're taking as well. Because I want to take money, raid tools, um, gems. I don't care about weapons. Maybe 50 cals and M200. Yeah, 50 cals, M200s only, I, I say. Five, four, three, two, one. No, not yet. Oh, the car's open. Nice. The car then has a tier four key and a tier three safe key card, and that's literally it. No, Dan, it's got fucking loads in you. Links mag, that's inside the car. Gunpowder, yeah. punched card, heavy vest, M107 mag. Loads of crates. Um, or, or loads of storage. Or sleeping oh, look bag. At, look at all the shit you can put inside the. Fucking... Oh wait, they've got they've got guns. They've got uh, heavy vests in there. Oh yeah, look <laughs> look at the barrels on the top of it. Yeah, yeah it looks <laughs> insane, bro. It's taking the kids camping. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a boring part. After after we get this all done and after we go through all these doors, we're gonna be filthy rich. I don't think you guys watching the video understand how how much loot is going to be in there. This is what's uh, the situation so far. We got one door, two doors, three doors, and the corridor to the right. Four, we got five, and then we got the six doors now trying to blow up. They, they take like 10 to 15 minutes, I think, for like one charge to blow up. Should we just dismantle this wall? I think we should just dismantle this one or this. Because then we, we, we can guarantee that if they come here and they try and rebuild their doors, and that they still have to, like, manage to block that wall off too. Don't think it's a bad idea. There we go, now we have access to the outside on the left there too, so that's good. We can also transport stuff easier to the car now. Oh. If we don't get exploded. Yeah, there's another one. <laughs> okay, next door. So. Let's hope these guys log in, man, I wanna fight. Wait, can we just like destroy the tent on the server, like to get the loot? Yeah, you can't shoot the tent so you can access it. No, no, you cannot access it. You can just destroy the tent and then you can access the ATV. Can you? Like, when I'm a code, I thought when a tent was code locked, you can't. It doesn't do anything. You, you know, how, like if you do this, it does damage. Look. Well, hang on. I got a couple of nades on me. I wanna. Invest that. Uh, last time he did this, he blew himself up. <laughs> have to, walk, yeah. have to run, mate. You see, he's pinned it back again. I think he pinned it back. <laughs> I did, didn't I? 
I, I gotta get it. <laughs> it's fine. You can you can throw another one. Okay. Okay. And just make sure this one's unpinned, and they'll both explode. It's short as fuck, bro. It's by the tree. Done it. Oh, nice. Look, it's damaged. Careful, oh, yeah. careful, careful. You know what? The other one might explode now. Okay, it didn't. See if it's on the floor still. Dead body, though. Yeah, it's my, oh, dead, my dead body. Is that in the particles? Oh, oh right, I see what you mean. You can see the ATB. Should, oh, I, should I unload into it? Let's unload. Go through the other side. Stop, 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 stop. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Wait. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I heard a snap at that, but. I did not know you could do that. But the carton is empty, and then the ATV is locked. Open. I think. Is it open? No, no. No, no. Carton's empty. Get in. M24 SWS, oh that's your hoods. Oh, you're in there. Careful. Get up, wait. Anything inside it? That's what I'm trying to figure out, so I'm gonna drive it out here. Stop, stop open the boot. Oh, uh, heavy vest. Hey. Helmet with night vision, pouches. Oh, here we go, here's stuff. Gilly. Oh, Ten. nades. Eddie. Bunch of nades, I'll take those. Next door is gonna go. Three, two, one, boom, boom. There we go. How far are we in? Oh, oh we got staircase. Loot. Yeah, we oh, got we got loot. Oh. We got two car keys. That might be for the ATV outside. Or the heli. They might have they might be key for their heli. Three, two, one, zero, one point five. Okay, we got another layer. What's up here? Up we go. Another ah. one. Another one. Another one. Right, so I've taken the uh, the car for a little, little spin. It's a little bit glitchy. I've, uh, <laughs> so for some reason this thing like decides to fly around, no, like this. It decides to fly around the map. And it doesn't, it doesn't do what it's supposed to do, so now I'm stuck. Daisy car mods on another level at this point, man. What? Bro. What? What the f... Bro. I'm getting out of this car. Oh no. Is he gonna do it? He's done it. I think it's good. Got stuck on like a garbage go. bar. Ooh, boom! <laughs> <laughs> <Fuck's sake. laughs> my car's like, oh, ever good. Oh, oh Whoa. my god, I almost, I almost just ran the over. <laughs> I closed my eyes. It was oh like my god. <laughs> nice man. Right, so this is door nine. Three, so theoretically, two, this should be one. the last. Like, Whoa, this, this should be hit. loot by now, right? It should be loot. Let what me see. Up? Oh, oh, we're going up and up and up and up. Oh. Got trash can. Oh, we got doors in the end of the corridor. Not sure what this is. Can we open them? I'm hurt badly. Yeah, Look can. at my health. <laughs> Why are you so low? <laughs> oh, we got safes. We got safes. We got grenades, but uh, nothing too crazy though. I'm on the top floor. We got a floor. tent you can open. We got uh, guns. We got R700s. We got AWMs. We got SRSs. We got AWMs. We got M14 ARX. M24 A3. M Inbill. We got a bunch of heavy plates. We got. Oh my word, the amount of 50 round foul drum mags they got in here, f***ing hell. Loads of boys. so many, okay they got M60s, they got more SRS's. We okay. need to get, oh we got more, what is in here? Man mine, some magazines, nothing too crazy yet. I haven't seen teppers, they're, 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 I know there's like crazy teppers, they probably have them. Oh, but we're not there's fully... like four or five car keys in here as well. Oh wait, there's more black. loot here, there's, like a, there's a safe, Love. car keys, yeah. Car key, I'm taking the car keys for the heli to test it. Backpacks, more. more guns, more more crazy guns, ARX, SA-58, ACR. I'm taking this PKM. This PKM is right now. Want any of them. Inbells we'll have. You want to end the inbells, bro? <laughs> Fuck it. Take the PKMs, bro. The PKMs are much better. I mean, SA-58 right. and inbells are good, too, but... Oh, this thing is full of PKM rounds. Uh, mags, I mean, pouches, masks, magazines, r under magazines, ACR magazines. X50 magazines and uh, a locker with a full kit for someone. Fifth four weight rounds, I'll take those. 
Uh, yeah. Interesting. Oh, I've got a backpack. There's more bells here. All Basket. scopes. We got scopes. There's we got loads, sleeping there's loads bags. I'm yeah, taking uh, farm mics downstairs. Yeah, we need to we need to meet to watch what's upstairs. You... Alright, oh, so this is shit. this layer, and there's another layer here That's with loot. And then this is the top layer, right, with the ladder. So you got this ladder, and then you got nothing really up there. It's all shit. Yeah, the last door's been blown though. Do you get all those fifty yeah. rounds? Yeah. Right. Damn, bro. I'm not to... exaggerating when there's about thirty of them. So what's on um, this floor? Maybe I'm exaggerating. Twenty, twenty-five. Wait, let me see. Oh, building stuff on this one. I guess building hatchet blanks, nails, and taking their book. It's probably yours, mate. Anyway, it might be to be honest. Bro. <laughs> to be fair, they they did like take my book and take my take my uh, all my shit. So we got we got uh, heavy plates, heavy oh, plates, some rope. suppressors, more guns, SRS, R700. Uh, these gun racks are filled with like average guns. Oh, he sorted all this out, didn't he? He said he was. Yeah, I mean, this is this is probably not even an, like a part of the stuff they might have, bro. Imagine what stuff's upstairs. If we if we already found this, imagine what they have upstairs. Got more heavy plates. Got masks. Night vision. More plates. More plates. More plates. Sleeping bags. Kits. Money. Car keys. Links. Mags. Heavy plates. Boom! 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 Let's boom! Boom! boom, boom. Let's go! Let's fucking go! Okay, we need to. We need to Five, be four, ready. Three. Two, one, one, boom. Pop. We need to be careful. There might be a guy of them just waiting Shot inside the base. Imagine there's some dude sitting in the corner waiting for us. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh what my the? god, bro. This thing is full of. Oh, they got these military crates here as well. And the pass codes. They've got they've got like twelve tents, sleeping bags. Bombs, yeah. Do you realize how large this faction is? Do you many? Do you know how, realize how many empty. sleeping bags? They've got lockers each, too. Go all them. Oh, khakis galore. All personal lockers, personal gun racks, 41 probably. gold bars. Nice. Okay, okay, that's huge. That's a lot of money. And then we got gun racks. We got... These are all empty, though. Meter crate. Uh, mags. Oh, yeah, got ammo. 50 Carl. 50 Carl. Links oh, a full, M107. <laughs> a full crate of ammo. A full crate of other types of... Oh, half crate of other types of ammo. Mags, guns. A full gun rack of SRSs and stuff. We got another crate with 308 ammo, full of 308 ammo pretty much. We got foul mags, we got M240 full mags, suit, yeah. M240s, we got full gun rack of M200, M240, the S58. How many, how many gun racks are there though? And then we got barrels in the back here too, what is this? Oh, look at the nails, sharpening stones, gold locks, nails, gold locks, nails, blanks, concrete bricks. Bars. Oh my god, okay, let me open these ones up. What's in here? We got. We got all that money, all the suppressors, space yeah. Fucking hundreds of them. Hundreds sleeping of them. bags, sleeping bags, space building storage. And then we haven't even opened all these lockers yet, which are probably Boys, personal lockers. Boys, this fucking hell, these AX50s here. This is as crazy, well. man. This oh is my god. nuts. Uh, yeah, and this, um, like, grey one there. Yeah, we got. Uh, I need a bag. <laughs> I need a bag. What do you want? AX50. We got more money. Yes, more 50 money. that is. I just got oh, all the money. shit. I got all the medical stuff over here. Fucking check those, probably. check the double, check the double lockers that are lined up by their sleeping bags. Yeah, they, they got the best stuff probably because it's personal lockers. Going up to the chopper. We got more, we got mags of all the peppers. Them. Pepper mags. We need to get them done. Here's the chopper upstairs. Sleeping bags, we got more stuff. We got pouches. <laughs> Bro, what in the world is this, man? Greenhouses, this is the weed farmer, we got more gun racks, a big, big, big helicopter, more barrels, more base building stuff, some random belts, some more guns. These, these guns don't even surprise me at this point, man. <laughs> we got probably the weed farm here, we got some uh, seeds, you've got the weed seeds, we got duct tape, more seeds, more, more weed stuff, growing stuff. Uh, this is the last floor, and then you, you got, yeah. This is this is the last top floor. This is it. And then there's some uh, source boxes over here too. It's closed. It's locked. And it's locked. I'm gonna try and see if I can unlock the chopper with the keys that I have because I got a bunch of them. I got like six, seven keys. The amount of stuff that's here, bro. I can't even. Let's test all the keys, bro. Let's test it all. 
This one doesn't work. This one doesn't work. This one doesn't work. I got it. I got it. Yeah, yeah, this is one. Let's go. We got the chopper. Oh, look at the amount of storage that's in here, too. Yeah, we're taking this chopper, because this chopper has so much storage. Wait, I just get hit by the hell. <laughs> this chopper has so much storage, we're going to open up the gate. And it's so... So it would have been the loot room, right? If, if the thing worked, our plan worked, it would have been the loot room, so it would have worked. That's crazy. That is mad. I don't even know how we're going to transport this all, to be fair. I don't even have a clue. This is way too much. Oh yeah, if you're watching this video, then uh, come and take it. The base is open. Well, it's open right now, I guess. Oh, there's more here. Do you want to come to me, um, Sid? What'd you find? What'd you find? Okay. There's, there's no way there's more tappers, right? If there's more tappers, I'm going to go crazy. Because we already have like a full... So in this green one here? This green one here, he said. Oh, we got more, yeah. Oh my, it's ammo. Are you talking about the tappers probably up here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Taking those. TDX links, links, links. I'm gonna burn this. This is prized possession, if you guys remember. This is prized possession. I'm burning this stuff. Oh, wait, this PTM's is the last. The this, one, um, this is the last 10, isn't it? Magazines. Last 10 is open. Have a look at. Oh, oh C4, yeah. C4, C4. It's gunpowder, C4. Hatchets, raid hatchets. Oh, money. Oh, the money. money. The money, the money. Money, bro, look at this. They got like 100 gold, but oh, we got another full 10 of, of raiding slash hammers. C4. The money. Oh, yeah. Raid tools. We Two got, oh my well. god. There's no way there's this much. Look at this. This is a full tent of raid oh, tools. Oh, my word. We need and to a full take crate of money. Bro. Right. Yep. And then there's, all, oh, there's so much stuff. We, we right. can't even take this off. a couple of runs then. Definitely. We're gonna be here all night. Bro, well, we've got to fill the two out. vehicles up. We should get everything then. Not yeah, not everything, actually, bro. we need to fill Sid's vehicle up as well, don't we? We're filling up everything. And we're <laughs> we gotta do multiple trips. This is crazy, bro. I'm, I'm filling up this bag with raid tools. Hold up. We need to get another bag, though, because I don't have a, enough. I don't have enough stuff, bro. There we go. We gotta start the engine. <clears throat> get, oh, right. Get creative. Yeah. Oh, God. Open those two other doors, please. But this is gonna be so. This is gonna go so wrong. <laughs> There's no way this topper fits through this gap. There's no way it does. Yeah, open them both up. Bro, there's no way you're gonna get that through. <laughs> this thing is so. Bro, it's going inside the. Bro, what? 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 Oh, God. What's going on here then? The helicopter is uh, somehow vertical now. This is interesting. <laughs> uh, this ain't looking too good, bro. <laughs> right, so they're sorting out the heli. I'm gonna go to the raid camp of all these raiding sledgehammers and the C4 that I just got. And I'm gonna deep all these raid tools in the raiding camp right now. This is it. This is it. Okay, I'm doing the first trip. Ah, this is crazy, man. The, the amount of stuff they have, it's just nuts. From this point on, I arrived at the raid camp and I stashed the raid tools away. Alongside with much more stuff, and we did many more trips. The guys managed to get the heli sorted, and the raid camp was also doing just fine. We finally managed to raid these guys, perfect revenge was served, and the new strategy was, yeah, didn't really work that well. I mean, it's a strategy that you guys could try and use. If you see a helipad, you can try and open the door from the top of the base, or from the bottom. Uh, and if that doesn't happen or doesn't work, you can always uh, do it the other way around. They're flying the helicopter off right now. They they succeeded with uh, the helicopter, and uh, yeah, this is this is just crazy, man. This must be uh, must be the the most amount of loot I've probably got from a, from the raid on any server.